TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Del Rey Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update, and currently we got a mixed bag out here. We'll start off. Well, actually, uh, I, I went right to the indice charts. Let's do that here. Well, let me d explain to the mixed bag. You got the Dow down 26, S&P down 4, Nasdaq's off 18, Russell's up 8, semis are off 17. Since we're at the end of the month, I thought what I would do here is we would go take a look at the monthly chart, see what kind of signals we have here. If we take a look at the Dow Jones, this is going to end in bar number six of a TD9 count. So we have no topping signal for it. That does not mean we don't see some type of September, October retracement. If we did, that retracement would target the 33,479 area but longer term and i do mean longer term the dow jones looks really good the same for the s p 500 it's going to generate bar number six here so really the same make out price could pull back to test 4169 that is not the call that we are making right now but things look good no major topping signal inside of the s p the ndx 100 is going to form bar number eight we know that a significant top can form on bars eight nine or the bar following nine so it could be a high this month uh, that is uh, set up here inside the index 100 with price pulling back perhaps to the 14 298 level. So potential for a topping signal inside the ND NDX, but that could also be a September, October signal. Inside the Russell 2000, it has a TD9 top. That has taken price back to the oscillator and change line. That did it last month, that did it this month, it held. So really its signal is more bullish to neutral. There you can see how price pulls back and tests that oscillator and same change line. The same thing with the semiconductor index. This is going to be bar number seven of a TD9 count. So no topping signal here. Again, during the month, price pulling back, testing that key level of support. Uh, right now that level of support is at 3201. In the case of the transports, um, unless there's an A to B equals CD, and I'd have to pull charts back further. I don't have really a topping pattern that is out here. Price pulling back, but still trade above that oscillator and change line for it. It remains strong. The Wilshire 5000, bar number six of a TD night count. The New York Stock Exchange, bar number five. Uh, price is well above its uh, prior TD night count. That's both for the Wilshire and the New York Stock Exchange. That has led to the higher high set. That's what's the signal here. So we're not seeing any kind of major topping signals inside our monthly indice charts out here. That does not mean that we don't get some type of a pullback out there. But if we do, what I really want you to prepare for is to really load up the truck because that could be the next buy of a lifetime. Folks, stay tuned for two more great hours out here. I'll see you tomorrow on a wonderful Wednesday. Have a terrific Wednesday.